in the interest of time, I'm jumping straight to the exact verse I care about most importantly. Surah 28, Ayah 38. Okay. And Pharaoh said, O chiefs, I know not that you have a God other than me. So kindle for me. Are you speaking on the Quran? Man? So oh, no, it's, a, it's a translation. So kindle for me, O Haman, to bake the mud and set up for me a lofty tower in order that I may survey the God of Moses and I consider him of the liars. Okay. Question to you is simple. When did the Egyptians bake the mud to build a lofty tower? When? Okay. First of all, he came to me, he said there is historical error in the Quran. There's a problem in the Quran. Correct? So you said. So my question to you, that's why I didn't want to let me speak. In order for you to say what is right, what is wrong in the Quran, you need to have a criteria, correct? So first of all, we know historically speaking, if we look, if we look back to the story of Pharaoh, not the Egyptian Pharaoh, the, the, the Pharaohs of the Egyptian, because we know the Egyptian always write their history. And we know this great history was not written according to the, the ancient Egyptians. So if you read to the Muslim scholars, historians, they were speaking about, there was a time when the Malachites, the Arabs, controlled Egypt. Even in the Western historians, they said there was a time when there was a, ga uh, a gap in the, history, uh, in, the, in the history of the Egyptian uh, pharaohs. And uh, uh, what do they call it in English again? Hoxes? Or? I can't remember what they call it anyway. The point Shamsi, is... I'm no, 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 Bake the mud to build the, the towers. The time when? when the time when the, uh, the Arabs control Egypt. And what evidence have we got for that? Okay, what evidence I got of that? The Muslim historians. They're not happy with you. We're not happy with Muslim Excuse me, Shamshi. For your information, you can go to. You are from Morocco, aren't you? No, no, I'm not from Morocco, but I have Moroccan in me. My grandma Moroccan. I'm Algerian. Oh, yes, you're Algerian. Yes. So Egypt is not far away from there. The Where is this point now? The, the fact of the matter, the fact of the matter is simple. We know, can you get the fact? The fact. The fact. The fact. The fact. The fact. Because I can't remember English. The fact of the matter. The fact of the matter is so simple. They did make. I said they did. Which is please find evidence. I'm, I'm eagerly looking forward to the evidence. No, no, wait, 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 no, 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 wait, wait, wait. The fact. Do you know evidence from where? No, no. In the meantime, wait. This is the meantime. The evidence from where? Wait. From any source of history. Anything. Is that history? Excuse me. Uh, uh, Bricks. Where is he? That's why he is married. You can't Shamshi. speak to him. Shamshi. Do you accept Islamic Bricks. history? Excuse me, Shamshi. Sham Bricks. My name is Shamsi, not Shamshi. Shamsi. You can say Shamshi, Shamshi. What is his name? Shamsi. Okay. Yes, what's what's it? my name? Huh? What is I don't name? know your name. And therefore, okay. forget, about, forget about taking moral high ground. No, but I don't know your it, name also. No, you know why my name. Know, you, why should I know your name? You can name say Shamsi, Shamsi. So you know my name. Anyway, anyway. Approximation. That's why I don't want to speak to Shamsi. Anyway, they did. Yes. We know plenty about. We know plenty. Uh, we know plenty. Okay, yeah, go on. Prior to Islam, the only source for information for the story of Musa and Pharaoh was the Torah and what is found with the Jews, okay, in the books. On the basis of the sources and the Western scholarship, the common view is that Pharaoh was an Egyptian captain, okay, in the mountain of or the mountain of Sinai, uh, Sinai, uh, Sinai, the Torah of Sinai is the Sinai of Peninsula, not in Arabia. That is the Israelites where they're forced to build pyramid of Egypt, despite the fact they are much earlier than the Israelites. The Israelites narration from Beni Israel, which is children of Israel, which are not free of exaggeration, will rely upon provi providing many of details of this story and they have shaped knowledge of this event. So Shamsi, I no, no, wait, wait, wait. no, 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 nowhere did I hear speak. about let me speak. No, let me speak, let me speak, okay, the Quran is, is a source of history, do you accept it? Well, the Quran says all sorts of fantasy things. Ah, okay, the Bible, no, wait, wait, he said, no, no, wait, 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 bro, bro, I'm gonna speak now, I have to speak, I let you speak for so long. No, you keep cutting me. I let you speak for so long. You keep cutting me, if you don't, I know you have, you speak for so long. Remember, you have a memory fish, memory, memory fish, I mean. I let you speak for so long. Look, I'm gonna speak. Bro, can I speak? No, no, can I speak? Obviously, okay. we can. We can okay, see that no. very clearly. Bro, no, 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 wait. What is, okay, the, you said to me clearly, give me any source of history. Did you say that? Yes, the Quran is a source of history. Do you accept it? No. Shamsi, the context is simple. Bro, I need to ask you that. Do you accept Quran as a source of history? Because no, you said, I don't. So why no. you said you accept any? No. Hypocrisy. Hypocrisy. Well, I, 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 I
What are you saying? I'm, I'm going to Do you listen to yourself? Excuse me, excuse me. I'm responding to you now. Please listen. Obviously, obviously, when I read a particular source and ask for evidence, yeah. I'm not asking you to show that source again. Obviously. No. This should be obvious. No, no, no. So, excuse me. One second. One second. When I read something from this book yeah. and ask you for evidence, yeah. I necessarily mean corroborating evidence, not for you to read the same thing again. Same if you do that, of course, every single statement in the world would be true. Okay. Oh, I am I am a I am an elephant. Well, what is what evidence is that? I just said so. It'd be silly. Okay. So, and therefore, in the context of what I did, obviously, I'm asking for evidence outside of the Quran. I could also help you in this. Okay. No, no. Before you help me, the help, the help that I could offer to you is Egypt is one of the few nations in the entire world for which we have unparalleled level of archaeological artifacts oh, oh, oh. Uh, you guys should have wait, 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 wait oh, we'll watch yes. everything yeah, yeah. everyone is watching remember, you have a don't memory. worry remember that don't worry remember that. don't worry just okay. answer the bro, don't tell me how to answer you have to let me speak okay, don't cut me all right good okay Egypt Plenty of artifacts. No, it's a lie. tower. No, no, tower. Is no, 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 at tower. At no, 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 tower. No, 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 Excuse me, bro. Tower. Next to my head. Let me speak. At tower. No, 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 wait, wait, wait. He's, he's getting frustrated. This man. He's next to my head. Let me speak. Let me speak. Who spoke before him? Huh? Who spoke before him? You were speaking before him. Excuse me. He was shouting before that. Is that your student? Is that your student? Carry on. Carry on. Just carry on. Carry on. So before you ask him, you should ask him first. No, he spoke. First. I know you have a fish memory. Don't worry. Go on. Go on. Some say I read. Anyway, doesn't matter. Okay. What matters is the truthfulness of the Quran. All right. Go on. That Let's is analyze. My, my problem is simple. Make mud. Yes. Show me one evidence out of the plenty of evidences from Egyptian archaeology. Yes. Just one. One of a mud baked brick based tower. Okay. First of all, now remember what he said. I know he has a fish memory, but everyone watch again. Okay, he said that if I ask you for a proof about an event, I don't want it from the same sources. I want it outside, which is logical. Uh, it's, cutting me. it's a logical. Okay, remember that I want you to be consistent because I'm going to speak about the issue. But remember the issue when the Bible said when Jesus was raised up and many people come out from the graves, dead people, they start walking in the streets. I want you to give me evidence outside the bro, 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 let me finish. I'm no coming answer. to it. No, I'm let, I'm let me finish. I'm Surah gonna, let, me, let, me, let me finish. I'm okay, coming to it. Okay. Just remember. There is I, no, 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 bro. Mud break bricks. Remember, this guy he is scared now. No, no. He's cutting me. Play. Yes. I so remember that. I'm gonna speak up. Go on. Go on. You know, in this country we have money. Okay. Thank you. All right, let me teach you. All right, Shabbat. All right. Go on. Stop touching me. By the way. Okay. Point here is I want you to be consistent. Okay? Now, if there is something in a book and you want to establish it is true, according to him, you have to go outside the book and look for it. So after I finish, I want my question to be answered. Because these Christians, they are the biggest hypocrites, missionaries. Let me specify it. Christian missionaries in the park, they are the biggest hypocrites. So the event of the dead people start walking up alive, come back to life after Jesus, uh, according to them, was dead or raised up, start walking. In Jerusalem outside okay now let's go back to it now as a Muslim I don't base the Quran to be the truth because of this story no as a holistic book there is many miracles in the Quran there is many proofs likewise from the author of the Quran likewise the prophetic tradition he's a prophecy to establish Prophet Muhammad is a true prophet and the Quran is a speech of Allah now is a condition every event that has been mentioned in the Quran in order for it to be true it has to be mentioned outside if this is the case, he's going to start drowning in his own urine, uh, sweat, okay? Now, the brother wants to give me a sign, okay? Read it out because you know just... Look, look, look. Here, Neil Silberman, 2002, in the Bible unearthed archaeology's new vision of ancient Israel and the origin of its ancient texts. Ziev Herzog, an Israeli archaeologist and a leading fig figure in the field of the histor historicity of the Hebrew Bible, wrote in 1999, Following 70 years of intensive excavations in the land of Israel, archaeologists have found out the patriarchs Abraham, Isaac, 
Jacob and Moses acts are legendary. The Israelites did not sojourn in Egypt or make an exodus. They did not Excuse conquer me. the land. Let it finish. Let it finish. Let it finish. Let it finish. Wait. 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 Let Calm down. No, no. Oh, you just finished. Yeah, but you didn't have a finish, no, no. You start cutting him. You this guy has a fish memory. See, if it's rotten him, he said he finished. Yeah. Bro, what are you serious? About? Okay, now, the story. No, no, let me finish. Bricks, bro, bro, I'm going to start. Egypt? I'm going to speak about it now. The Medbag brick, the historians, the Muslim historians, they said it was not the Egyptians, which is the Egypt in our time. This happened amongst the Arabs, who the fact he was, they ruled parts of Egypt. So the story of Musa happened with Fir'aun, whose name was an Arab name. And the, the, the Muslim historians, the likes of Ibn Jarir Tabari, who died, he uh, was alive 300 years after Prophet Muhammad and he was a big historian, even Oxford University, they recognized him to be one known profound historian. He mentioned the story of Moses with Fir'aun is not the one that wishes the Bible got wrong, because the Egyptians are known to write down history, and they never wrote down the history of Moses. So if you go to Egypt now, Shamsi. there is many histories. Shamsi. How come? You have been, 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 you have I have a brain to process things. No, repeat what I said. Repeat what I said. What did I say? I need to repeat. No, 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 no. I'm not a Muslim. I don't repeat things. The story of Moses for the viewers. The story of Moses in the Quran is not more. It's not the Egypt that is known now. Okay, sure. Egypt. Thank you, Mr. Thank you for your great contribution. So, so, so you asking me question about the Egyptian archaeologists is a wrong term. It's a wrong premise. You had try one. He had try two, and then you came back with try three. And well, no, no evidence. No, no. What was no, it no, 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 excuse me. Wait, please. Excuse wait, please. No evidence. Time. No evidence. There is evidence. Excuse me. Historians, I'm actually historians. Excuse me. No evidence whatsoever for mud baked bricks. And what are the what are the responses you came up with? A bit childish. When I talk, who you did say childish? When when, when when I was talking Shams about mud baked. Let everyone understand the point. When I am talking why, why about. Excuse me, please. Excuse me. Why are you scared? Why are you scared? Where is he pointing? Where is he pointing? Is one yeah. side speaks first time yeah. and the other side responds. Like you cut me. That's the no, idea. No, but what's the case? It's not because it's mean. Because it's mean. Because it's mean. Because it's mean. We're lying. But anyway, anyway, go ahead. The point is rest of time. Go ahead. No evidence for mud bricks. Thank you. Now, when have given the evidence? It's not just the fact that you did not provide any evidence for mud big bricks. I did. Historian Ibn Jarir Tabari. Excuse me. You said Ibn Jarir. Excuse me. Excuse You're lying against me. Don't say excuse me. I said Ibn Jarir Tabari is not Quran, is a historian, which is recognized by Oxford University to be a profound scholar. I'm do you waiting. accept him? I'm no, waiting. no, do you accept him? Yes or no? Excuse me, Shamsi. Do you accept him? Games yeah, yeah, bro, because bro, this guy... It's you, my turn now. No, 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 before you turn, you, know you accept him. No, you lied against me. You said you know I have not, profound, bro, have not provided evidence. I did. You know, do you accept it? The evidence out of the Quran now. You, do you accept it? If you know how to listen, if, if I listen, you lie and guess me, did you? You said I have not provided evidence. If you can stay quiet okay, for some time, please. I did from outside the Quran. If you can stay quiet, okay. please, for some time. Thank you. Bro, don't lie and guess me because you get angry frustrated. I'm not getting angry. Keep lying. In a very I'm not getting angry. I'm, 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 we I'm are Julians, Moroccans, Tunisians. That's how we get speak. No, I'm asking we are you very you know, energetic. Let, 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 let him say it. Watch. Passion doesn't help. You need knowledge and you need the truth. It's the guy who says, God, because human being, he said no, 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 no. So, so go speak. Point Go. number one. A point, book. Yeah. Point, point number one. You did not provide any evidence for mud baked bricks as a tower. No, 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 mud baked bricks as tower. Okay. The best evidence you gave me was Al Tabari, who comes even after Muhammad. Al Tabari is not a witness for Pharaoh during the time of Moses. Not a witness. No, 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 no. Al Tabari is not a better witness than your Quran. It's a worse witness. If it all, if it all, it's a witness. Okay. So forget about using Al Tabari. Now, coming back to number one. No evidence. No, no, I didn't ask my question. My question, give me evidence outside the Bible when the dead people come back to life, start walking in Jerusalem. 
Yeah, give me. If you, yeah, because you listen if you outside the Bible. If you, yes, question if you, now. If you, let, you have to be consistent. If you, yes. if you let me speak. I'll let you even speak to tomorrow as long as you give us evidence. Okay. Okay. Doesn't seem to be happening. Okay, when is that going to happen? No problem. Brothers, give him five minutes. If I ask him a question, everyone, even the non Muslim, be just. My question to him he said, before you accept the story in the book, he has to be outside evidences. So there's a story in the Bible when the dead people come back to life, they start walking in Jerusalem. That is in the Bible. So I want, I, I want him to give me an evidence outside the Bible that has been mentioned. I would mention that multiple okay. times already. Okay, khalas, go on. Good. Five minutes, I'm going to give you five minutes. Go on, go on, go on. When is that Kalas going to happen? doesn't seem to be happening. He likes to come and sit there. Just talk. talk. Good. Good. Five minutes. Mud bag bricks is, an act, uh, is incorrectly placed during the time of Pharaoh. Uh, of uh, during the time of Moses, incorrectly placed, just in the wrong time, in the wrong land, incorrect. What evidence have you shown? Nothing. What evidence can I show? The contrary evidence I can show to you that this can't be true at all is the fact that mud baked bricks, towers based on that, are archaeological artifacts. The fact of the matter is, we find plenty of archaeological artifacts in Egypt, but no mud baked brick. And therefore, the idea of mud baked brick based artifact and the fact that there, there exists none despite having plenty of archaeological artifacts in Egypt tells you that this is a fantasy idea misplaced in time and space. Perfect. Point number one, in regards to the Bible, what evidence can I show outside of the Bible for these dead people coming back alive? Yeah. Outside of the Bible, stay quiet. Dead. <laughs> Go on, go on, Bismillah, Bismillah, go on, outside, Bismillah, go on, outside, go on, Bismillah. Outside of the Bible, I can't show... Oh! Oh! Hypocrite! 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 Let me quote some anger. Biggest Munafiq, Abdullah ibn Salul, is lesser than you. Carry on, carry on, I got in five minutes, carry on. Allah, for, 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 for your... Uh, you know what, I told you you come to the wrong guy. You have a fish memory, brother. For no, your, brother, you have a fish memory. For your information, so this is Man, England, fish. we have manners. No, no, no. Which is what you said earlier. Man, no, I'd like to just repeat them. Manners, manners to expose the hypocrites. I don't, I don't. That's a good manners to expose the expose hypocrites. Excuse me. So carry on. Part of manners, is so expose the hypocrites. That's part of manners. Continue with your point. Time also, is up. listen. No, no. Before you listen, you expose hypocrites. So, four mud bag bricks. No, 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 no. The story of the dead people. So you have no outside and you say accept it. So your criteria when before we accept do it. Do you? Do you have the capacity no, to listen? To one, yeah. Do you have the you capacity to listen? No, one second, point one. We really have the capacity to listen. Point one. We have many. Yeah, watch this, watch this. Do you have the capacity to listen? Listen, listen. 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 You, did, you, you, you did make two points. You made points. You don't seem to be doing that. No, watch this, your point one. No, no, Shamsi. Does everyone understand? Does everyone understand this Excuse me, sir. You can move away. Why do you need to go away? Why do I need to go away? It's a free country, yeah? That's a question. Yeah, so I need to go. Honestly, honestly asking you to listen. He cannot accept. Honestly, asking you to listen. Before, we, no, no, we have the first point. Where the Egyptian said that? He said you cannot build. If I honestly, you cannot build what? You mud bricks. Mud bricks. Where the Egyptian said that? And are the Egyptian God to know everything? How you do it? Honestly, ask you to listen. This guy, fish memory. Go on. Honestly, ah. You mentioned the term fish memory multiple because times. Because you keep forgetting what you said, brother. It's, it's a bit silly that you keep No, it's not. To remind you. Because, it's, it's because bit, remember, it's you keep forgetting silly. that you have fish memory. It's a bit silly that you're doing that. Bro, can you speak? First, first Which point. I can. If you stay okay. quiet, please. Okay, go on. For some time. Right. Thank you. How long, how long are we going to be here? Till the end of the If you give me some time to speak, you might get some answers. Okay, go on. Good. Yeah. Might break. One minute. Tell us. Yeah. Two minutes to be speaking. Six minutes. Let him finish. Let him finish. Let him finish. Might break bricks. Yeah. You can't provide an evidence, I can provide counter evidences. Counter evidences from the fact that plenty of archaeological artifacts, but zilch of mud baked brick towers. Counter evidence. And we're not listening. Counter evidence. Let me finish. Let him remember that he's doing a job for us for Christian to be. Never have the habit of listening. Never. Never have the habit of listening. Can you speak, please? Go on. I'm gonna If you stay quiet, if you stay quiet, thank you. In contrast, go to the dead people coming back alive. I can't provide any evidence outside of the Bible. Can you provide counter evidence that that did not happen? Can you do that? Wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 wait. 
So look to the hypocrisy. You counter evidence that the, the, the Prophet Muhammad, uh, Prophet Moses, and with the Pharaoh never happened. What is it? Because you saying no, no, no. The counter because, evidence. If I could repeat, no, no, no. Let me understand. No, let me understand. That's not, that is not a fact. No, no, look. The counter uh, no, evidence me, is the fact that finish. there are multiple. Hundreds of archaeological artifacts in Egypt. Yes, yes, yes. You must listen. You must listen. You must listen. You must listen. listen. Look, yeah. the look we need to speak to Christian missionaries. If you, 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 if we have a full camera. We said, "Come to listen." He was quiet. No Christian. Be just, in there. Be just. Be just. Okay. Now the point here is that the Christian missionaries is like, I have twenty billion pound. Who is the proof? No proof to me. I don't have it. What? Hold a minute. You're claiming, so you have to bring a proof. Not me, I have to disprove you're wrong. Bro, lend, 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 let me finish. Yeah, no, proof you know, you to, the proof is upon you, not upon me. Because you already laid down the criteria. It was not my criteria, it is yours. That if an event took place, if we read it in a book, in order to accept it to be true, we have to go outside, correct? Now, let me make it more clearer to the non-Muslims as well. Can you give me proof from the archaeologists? The Egyptian archaeologists, yeah? Where is found Moses and the Israelites? Because we know the Egyptian, they wrote history of theirs. They wrote it. They wrote down everything. How come, as the brother read out to you, from an Israelite, not from me, an Israelite, who said the stories of Moses, archaeologists, he said that never exists in Egypt. No evidence that occurred. That occurred. Okay, now I have an encounter. Wait, wait. I have an encounter. Something I guess you story in the Bible concerning move concerning Moses and Pharaoh. That the historians read it out. Let me read it out again. Let me read it out. To show you. 70 years of intensive excavation. How many years? 70, 70 years. years. How many years? 70. 70. You know 70 and was seven. Okay. In the, in the land of Israel, archaeologists have found out. The patriarchs Abraham, Isaac, Jacob and Moses acts are legendary. The Israelites did not sojourn in Egypt or make an exodus. They did not conquer the land. Neither is there any mention of the empire of David and Solomon, nor of the source of the belief in the God of Israel. These facts have been known for years. But Israel is a stubborn people and nobody wants to hear about it. Who this is, is what archaeologists have learned from the, uh, from, when they, uh, from the excavations in the land of Israel. Most of those who are engaged in scientific work in the interlocking spheres of the Bible. Yeah. <laughs> so now, 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 Give us, give us archaeologists yeah. who went to Egypt. Who show us, them. no, 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 show me. No, no, wait, 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 wait. wait. Now, about the, the mud, you know what the mud thing? That if you go to if Oman, you, no, wait, wait. If you, Let if me you stay quiet. If you go to Oman, he, he many spoke. countries, he be built by, by what? He already spoke. 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 Let me he speak. already spoke. Bro, who is he? Is he on your evidence. side or not? He's on my side, yeah. He already spoke. Yeah, but we haven't finished yet. Six minutes. Yeah, yeah. He's, he's just spoke. reading out. Yeah. He's just reading out. I cannot Speaking see to you is a huge challenge, some change. Thank you very much. Yeah. 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 That's why you should come to me. He yeah, said this. challenge. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Challenge bro, 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 is not bro, bro, a good no, thing. Bro, bro, bro. No. So wait, 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 wait. So there's two things here that we can see clearly. That the fact right. that you can't let provide evidence. Let me finish. 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 Yes. Two things here. No what? five minutes. Bro, 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 bro. Just who told you about five minutes? <laughs> <laughs> who is that? Is that Shamshi's assistant there? No. No. Shamshi's no. second assistant. Anyway, there. anyway, the story of the baked mud. You can go clear to Oman and many countries. Yeah, how, when you go Egypt. to Egypt, bro, bro, I'm, no, Egypt. I told you it's not Egypt. One thousand five hundred. Bro, 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 your promise is false. Akhir Lamif, your promise is false because the story of Moses in the Quran, we don't believe took place in Egypt. Exactly. Which you believe is Egypt? And it's it's another land. Oh, 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 so you're wrong. You, uh, let me finish. Where your promise is wrong. Fantasy. Let me finish. Let me, let me finish. Oman. Let me finish. Let me finish. Oman. Let me Oman. Story of the baked mud. You can go clear to Oman and many countries. I didn't say Oman. Listen, learn how to Pharaoh listen. Pharaoh not in Egypt. No, where, 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 where,
Read the Bible. He can go outside the Bible. So don't let me finish. Let me finish. Don't ask me. Let me finish. 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 Let with Pharaoh, you understand? The land was shouting. Bro, anyone with Muslim any Arab is in Egypt. Bro, bro, Muslim, I'm talking about Pharaohs ruled in Egypt. Bro, bro, bro. No, 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 no. You have to learn. You have to learn. Who did not rule in Egypt? Bro, he's not going to finish. He's not going to finish. Don't finish the Bible. Okay, there is an Arab Pharaoh. Okay, let me. There is an Arab, the Malachite. One of their kings was called Pharaoh, and that was the story that Amalekites. Bro, bro, bro. I mean, a let king me speak. of Amalekites let me, was a Pharaoh. Let me speak. Which, which king was this? Can I speak? If you are how did you learn? Well, if I let you speak for five minutes, it's already five. Before you learn how to listen, listen. You know, advise yourself first. Pharaoh, you advise me. In Amalekites. Let me finish. Let me finish. Now, if you go to the history, even amongst the, the, the Western historians, they will tell you when you read the history of Egypt, clearly the Egyptians were known to write down the history. But the history of Moses is a great history. That Moses and the Pharaoh was drowned in the water, was destroyed, the army and everything. It's not written. How is it not written? But when you go to the Muslim historians, Alhamdulillah already knew about the archaeologists of our time. That yes, Moses and the story of Moses and Pharaoh is not what the people think Egypt our time. Because Arabic Muslim mean the land. And the Muslim historians mentioned it was a different place. Now, now wait, 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 wait. Before we go off, to anything your premises was wrong to begin with your, do you accept your, that your statements are completely uh, take a historical history. Yeah. Historic. in the bible Histor don't be, don't be. Anyway, prove to me that uh, historic dead people come back to life historically that prove to me dead people come back to life historically prove to me dead people come back to life don't be in the bible prove to me dead people come back to life incorrect prove to me dead would people come not back to life even get you prove through to primary me. schooling prove to me yes <laughs> the guy who believed that people come back to life in Jerusalem no one wrote it down i believe in god who can raise dead people back to life I believe, I believe in God. I believe in God. Doesn't do it. No, no. And wait, wait, wait. This I'm, is a bit of no, a no, I believe you. in God. I appreciate that. Create nation and disappear them. I see. I see this guy. Mizraim. Look at hypocrisy. He's a hypocrite. Well, I'm wasting my time. Mizraim. Anyway, can you prove it? Mizraim. No, no, before you tell Mizraim, Israel, Mizraim. No, no, before, before. Provide to me outside evidence from the Bible. Mizraim. Outside the Bible, about people come back to life. Mizraim. Can I prove to me what lies a rock? Zombies in the Bible. He made a claim to us to me. He said, I cannot prove it, but you have to disprove it. No, no, no. The, the That's claims. That's not what I the, said. Did he say I that? Said, he said that. I said. No, no, I don't speak to you. I said. You have a fair. No, no. I said. Big bricks. No, listen, no, 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 don't lie. Best when I say to you supremacy. about the people coming back to life, said you said to me you cannot prove it. Bricks, you said you, you can't give evidence. Okay, this guy is I can give counter evidence. No, we can't. You can't prove. And therefore, no, it's not, it's not, clearly, it's not it's evidence. wrong. It's not. It's not wrong. For dead people because coming back your alive is wrong. during the time of Jesus. Yeah. I can't provide evidence okay. outside of the Bible. Okay. Can you provide counter evidence? No. You simply you can't. Made claim. You made. I can. I can. I can. I can. I can. The Romans. The Romans. What's the evidence? I tell you. The Romans. Come back alive. Yeah, the Romans were known to write, to write history. Really? Are you, yeah. Which really? Romans? Uh, which? 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 No, no. which? Well, I'll give you the evidence. Come on, let's go. Thank you. Can you show your face to the camera? Brother, this is it. This is it. Thank you. Can you, can you please come here, show your face and then go? I can't see your face. So, oh, well, if, if people came back from the dead, if yeah. people came back from the dead, no, no. It would can be you show your face in front of the camera? No, I can't, sorry. Then, then, then I need to wrap up here. The fact of the matter is this: Surah 28, Ayah 38, talks about mud baked bricks. A tower based of mud baked bricks. Two. There are three problems actually. Uh, there are multiple problems in this uh, surah. Two problems in this particular verse that I'd like to point out to. Number one, mud baked bricks used uh, to build uh, large towers did not happen in Egypt. 
not certainly during the time of Moses. Number one. Number two, mud baked bricks and uh, climbing up that to go and check out if God of Moses was there is again an anachronistic idea. Anachronistic idea that to me seems like comes from the time of Tower of Babel. Obviously, someone who wrote this did not know the time difference between the Tower of Babel and Moses in Egypt. Because they did not know the time difference and because they did not know the place difference, because that happened in China, the land of China, Babel, Babylon. Because they did not know the difference between the geography and the time, they obviously used this example here. I have reasons to think, perhaps this is one of the reasons why people never let the Quran, people, people, uh, people advance this idea that the Quran must be read only in Arabic. Because it seems like when foreigners began, uh, when foreigners begin reading the Quran in their own mother tongues, they figure out all these problems. And to me, it seems like that could be a reason why the foreigners who knew about their own lands, Egyptians who knew their own land at that time, I'm not talking about Egyptians today, Egyptians of that time and uh, and Babylonians of their time would know that something is seriously wrong here and to me it seems that that might be a good reason why the Quran was asked to read what was asked to be read only in Arabic anyway coming back to the point incorrect ideas related to Egypt Shamsi seems to think that the problem uh, my my logic has a problem which is that he can't give evidence and I can't prove that to be incorrect. My point is not that. My point is, he can't give me evidence for mud baked bricks based tower and I can give him the lack of evidence despite the fact that there are plenty of archaeological evidences in Egypt. And that is counter evidence. In other words, we're not talking about a simple lack of evidence. We're talking about lack of evidence in a place where there are plenty of evidences for all sorts of other things. In other words, it seems like this story is a fantasy story which do just doesn't fit in there. Obviously, Muhammad said this. Why did he say this? Excuse me. I'm, I'm not a Hebrew Israelite, I'm a Christian. Excuse me, I am a Christian. You ran away from me, Shamsi. You ran away from me, Shamsi. I don't know why you're here again. If you want a proper debate, we can do that. Fact of the matter is, Muslims across the world, there are plenty of errors in the Quran. Plenty. Some of which are crucial historical errors. Based on that, when the Quran contradicts with the Bible, you can clearly see which book got it right. Shamsi again spoke about uh, the, 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 the assistant of Shamsi who stood behind him, said there is no evidence for the kingdom of Israel. And this is a laughing matter because to me it seems like he is not educated even in the alphabets of the historical resources available to back up the historicity the of the nation of Israel. Tell Dan Stile, Mernapta Stile, what does he know about them? To me, it seems like nothing. All that he knows is refer to Prophet Google, get a couple of articles somewhere, read things which suits his beliefs. That's what he has done. The Bible is uh, trustworthy. The Bible is reliable, historically, theologically. And ultimately, in the Bible, what do we find? God of the heavens and the earth who created mankind against whom mankind disobeyed and therefore came in the judgment that God is a very compassionate God not, not like the Islamic Allah of the Quran but a very compassionate Yahweh and that Yahweh over a couple of millennia told the nation of Israel that he was going to send his own son his own son was going to come in as a as a sin offering as a as an offering for our redemption and that is precisely what Jesus did Jesus came in to this world gave up his life for us on the cross not because he couldn't say anything against it but because he wanted to go through that Jesus willingly laid down his life but thankfully also Jesus came back alive on the third day the power of resurrection 
the resurrected Lord Jesus Christ is able to bring you and me back alive after we are dead. It is that God who can bring us back alive, who can give life to the dead that we really need to follow. Everyone else is just a wannabe, but Jesus alone is God eternal with real proven track record of supernatural power. Yahweh of the Bible is the only one who is worthy to be followed. Muslims across the world, I earnestly commend to you, you need to come to Jesus and follow him. Jesus is the way. Jesus is the one who would let us into heaven. There is no one else who could save us except for Jesus. Come to Jesus and you would enjoy a very happy life. Jesus said, those who believe in me shall not die and even if they die, they shall come back alive. That is the Jesus I invite you all to God's richest blessings to you all. Thank you.